hey guys welcome back to my channel i am doing a review and what's in my bag between these two more like a comparison and not a review between the nano speedy from louis vuitton and the ysl toy lulu from ysl i also want to mention that i got this wristband for my birthday this wristband um i bought it from a seller on instagram i will link the seller's information down in the description box but it's absolutely gorgeous let me take it off for you guys to see so it looks just like this this is how the back looks and this is authentic gucci material all leather I absolutely adore this watch. It's really, really nice. I love the color and it matches my Gucci handbag and sneakers. I don't have any Gucci um, Supreme or Fidia print that matches with this in a, in a, like a card holder or key pouch. I eventually want to get one that would match with my purse, my shoes, and this wristband. Okay, so let's get back to the video. So I used this bag today and I'm gonna show you exactly what I put inside and what fit, fits inside. And then I'll put the same items in here as in here. The difference between these two besides maybe the width is this because the way it's shaped, it holds a lot more in it. It's canvas material, it's stretchy and it holds a lot more than this holds. So I've done a what's in my bag between these two. I'll link them both in the description box and also in the cards up above. So you guys already know what fits in um, both of these bags. But I'm going to just show you in comparison next to each other. All right, so we're going to start with the YSL Toy Lulu. My iPhone fits in here. I don't have my iPhone with me, but it does fit in this bag along with the other things I'm going to put in here. All right, so... We'll start with the mini pochette first because you have to put this in first before you put the other items so it would fit. So in here I have, you know, samples of Chanel perfumes, my medicine container, um, hand lotion. I also put my AirPods in here too because I can't bring my other pouch because it can't, I can't fit two pouches in here. I can only fit one pouch in here, so I had to put this in here. And I have my favorite Dior lip balm as well and some other things. So that all fits in here. So I'm going to put in this compartment first. This compartment is the widest part of the entire bag. And this one to me is a lot smaller. So as you could see how this part looks bigger on camera than this side. So this is how I'm going to place it in just like this. And it fits and then you can open it up get whatever you need to to get out and then you can close it all right so next i'll put my six ring key holder that i put in the back all right and then i have my key file my key pouch where i put my car key that fits in the back and then I have my YSL card holder. I don't need to take this card holder with me because in the front over here, you could add a card and it has a slip pocket as well to put cards. But I like to take this with me. And that's the reason why I bought this card holder because it matches with the bag. But it's really not necessary that you need a card holder because this is like a, a, what you call this? A wallet, chain on wallet or a wristlet. So, but I'm gonna take this with me anyway and I'm gonna put it towards the back so as you can see right there it fits and yes my phone does fit it stretches enough to fit an iphone 12. see it closes it doesn't bulge or bulk up but that's all i could fit in this bag now we're going to transfer everything here into here we'll start with the mini pochette goes right in there and still there's a lot of room let's add the key fob key pouch six ring key holder and my YSL card holder
and it fits with some room in the back here. Also, I could keep, I could fit my iPhone in here as well. So I can't really show you because I'm recording. Here's some more SLGs. And I could also, if I wanted to, take the AirPods out of the mini pochette and put it on the side. So I'm going to close this up and tuck it in the side of the bag. Or I could leave it on top. So if I need to get it, my phone rings, I can answer my phone with the AirPods. And this closes up no issues I usually keep change in here or um, cash so this could fit in here too let me take the airpods out see that little space that's where I keep the airpods it's a little bit heavy so I won't put anything else in here but it's fully compacted in. Everything fits in. I love this bag so much. Now, if you want to take your old-fashioned AirPods, this is what I use to hold my AirPods, you could put that in here too. I might stand this upright so I can have a little more room. And so I'll stand this upright as well. So I keep those two in there. I have to take away this so I can have more room to put more stuff in it. All right, and then let's put this upright too, my YSL card holder. That's everything upright. Let's see if it closes. And it does. <laughs> Let me see. And I could probably put this in the corner here like so. Hope you guys can see. And then you can close it. This is a little too much, but I'm just trying to show you what fits inside. This, I'm gonna take this out because it's a little too tall and I'm gonna try to push it in the back and then I'm gonna close it. And it fits. And I'm gonna take everything out. This, I can't put in there because it just, too much I mean I could try but it'll be pointless to try to fit it in here oh it does go in okay let's see if it closes and it does closes yeah this is a little too much it's getting wonky on the top yeah we don't need all that in there but it's just interesting to know that this all fits in here so I'm gonna move this on the side I'm gonna take everything out YSL, I said YSL, Louis Vuitton reverse monogram card holder, six ring key holder, Hermes Bastia coin purse, YSL card holder, um, round coin purse, my LV mini agenda, my key pouch, my AirPods, and last but not least is my mini pochette. And the mini pochette and this are similar in length, but it kind of fits in if you just make it, if you just angle it on the side and push it down, it fits. And then we're going to take it out, just angle it again, and that's it. But yeah, there are similar in length, so you don't have to take the mini pochette with you. You could if you want to. I like taking my mini pochette with me because I have a lot of stuff in here, and I don't want to keep it dangling all at the bottom. Or I could get a smaller pouch where I could put this in because they do make um, limited edition smaller mini pochettes, and I could get one of those so I could use it in like bags like this, but it's not necessary. All right, guys, thanks for watching my video. As you can see, certain things fits in the YSL Toy Lulu, 
and certain things fits in the Speedy Nano. The Nano, like I said, holds a lot more than the YSL Toy Lulu. But if you guys already know, perhaps, that they already came out with the Speedy 20, which is a little bit bigger than this. And the Speedy 20 will definitely fit all this without any, you know, wonkiness to the zipper or anything like that. And with this... I wish that this middle compartment was not there, but it's there and there's nothing you could do about it. But yeah, and also I don't use the back pocket here because they have a back zip pocket. To me, it's pointless. I don't use that. All right, guys, thanks for watching my video. If you like it, please give me a thumbs up. Please leave any comments you have down below. Please click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post another video. Guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for always liking and leaving comments. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.